Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another fantastic. That's not straight. Fan Woo! Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another fantastic day on planet Earth. I hope that recorded. It was recording, it was on screen, and it was going. F GoPro, you piece of shit. Anybody on watching now, have you ever seen Benefit Street? This place here, which there isn't a name, they took the nameplate off, or somebody's stolen it. It was all filmed in these houses here. Look at the state of it, man. <laughs> Unemployed. Unemployed. You see this street here? James Turner Street was one of the best streets. Unemployed. Unemployed. No. One of the worst. It's those houses on the front, which is where it was filmed. And all down, it was down this street as well. What's that, Beaton Road? So we're on Beaton Road now. And that, the fat woman, whatever her name was, she lived in number 148, was it? The bloody state of it. There you go. A bit of history. This is one of the roughest areas anywhere. It's so dangerous around here. I'm not scared. This bridge is the, the drug central of absolutely everywhere. Look at all the bloody bags. Oh my God. Here is Black Patch Park on the right hand side where Charlie Chaplin was born. Yes, I've been very 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 busy i have um finished the living room i've finished the spare room i've finished chloe's room i've had to redo all the hallway i've redone my bedroom completely stripped it as you know um i'm now working on the bathroom and then i'm going to work on the kitchen i the bathroom, the ceiling's artexed. Now, I don't want to take it off because I don't know what's underneath it. I don't know what it's hiding, to be honest. I I'm, not, I'm not chancing that one. No, 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 no. I think it's the shortest date. Is it the shortest? No, it isn't. It's Christmas Eve. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. It's Christmas Eve. At the end of January, I'm putting the flat on, mark, on the market because it'll be finished by then. I want to make everything perfect, absolutely 100% perfect. So it's going on the market at the end of January, um, and then I'm leaving the country. <laughs> I am. I'm leaving. I'm going. I don't know. I don't exactly know when yet. Um, obviously, I've got paperwork that I have to set up or find or organise. I don't know what I need yet. I've never sold a property before in my life, so I haven't got a clue what I need. You hear that? That's the aerial. The aerial downstairs has got an aerial on, on the roof and that resonates through the bloody building. But anyway, I'll catch you soon, lads. Enjoy Christmas. Enjoy New Year, but I will be here before then. Get pissed, spend loads of money, get fat, feel sick, and enjoy every second of it. Good afternoon, no, good evening. I don't know what time of day it is. Good whatever. We're very close to New Year. Uh, the 5th of January, which is, which is a Friday, is the first day of me being unemployed. So time is a sort of a limitation now. Um, I'm basically living on my savings, which isn't a lot. I was talking to my mum recently and, um, and my mum said, you, you've had a shit life and she wants me to have the best, to do what I want to do, to enjoy life now. Uh, I have had nothing but shit throughout my life. Everything that I've tried has gone wrong, but this, there's been no real hurdles. Everything has gone 
pretty much straight. Chloe has been my inspiration in all this, believe it or not. I taught her how to live life. She came in here and I remember when I was painting the living room door, she wouldn't even say excuse me. She was just a shell. She wasn't a proper person in my eyes. She, she didn't know how to live life. She got no idea whatsoever. And I taught her that you can do whatever you want to do. And then she did it. I'm quite happy that what I've done is the right thing and I'm quite happy that what I'm doing is the right thing um, I've got all the tools that I need to succeed and there's only me that's going to stop me from succeeding 5th of January the state agents are coming in probably spend about an hour tell me what I need to get I found out there's still 98 years left on the lease she's told me that I need uh, a form of identification as in a passport or a driving license which is fine and also a utility bill how many people have got a utility bill I mean what how the bloody hell everyone says go paperless and then they want to see paper I said that 2023 was the year for me that rhymes 2024 is my year it's the year that I'm gonna succeed I am I'm going to work as many hours as I possibly can just to succeed because I want to prove my dad wrong.